Did you know that every pigeon, sparrow, and eagle you see today is actually a living dinosaur? Sounds crazy, but it's true. Thanks to groundbreaking fossil discoveries and cutting edge scientific techniques, we now know that birds evolved directly from their prehistoric ancestors. From scanning ancient fossils to reconstructing their brains in 3D, and even studying how they developed shimmering feathers, scientists are rewriting the history of bird evolution. Let's understand the evolution of birds. The journey to understanding bird evolution began when paleontologists uncovered fossils that looked like a strange mix of dinosaurs and birds. The most famous of these was Archaeopteryx, a 150 million year old fossil with both feathers and sharp claws. This was the first clue that birds might have evolved from dinosaurs but it took decades of research and modern technology to prove it. As fossil evidence grew, scientists discovered that some small feathered dinosaurs shared striking similarities with modern birds. But the real breakthrough came with advanced scanning and imaging technologies, allowing researchers to examine fossils in incredible detail without damaging them. One of the richest fossil sites, China's Jehobiota, revealed remarkable finds like Cynoceropteryx, a dinosaur covered in primitive feathers. These discoveries confirmed that feathers evolved long before flight, possibly for insulation or display. Birds, it turned out, weren't just related to dinosaurs, they were dinosaurs. One fossil changed everything. In China's Zhenhe County, paleontologists unearthed Bamanornis gengensis, a 150 million year old bird fossil that rewrote our timeline of bird evolution. Unlike Archaeopteryx, which had a long, reptilian tail, Bamanornis had a short tail ending in a pigastyle, the structure modern birds use for balance, in flight. Scientists once thought short tails first appeared in the early Cretaceous, but Bamanornis pushed this evolutionary milestone back by 20 million years. This means birds began evolving their modern features much earlier than previously believed. So Perhaps as far back as 172 million years ago, nearly 10 million years earlier than scientists once estimated. What makes Bamanornis even more fascinating is that it was a mix of old and new. It had advanced shoulder and pelvic structures like modern birds, but retained dinosaur-like hands, proving that different parts of the bird's body evolved independently over time. One of the most exciting breakthroughs in paleontology is the ability to scan fossils and create 3D models of ancient bird brains. Using high-resolution CT scans, scientists can digitally reconstruct brain cavities, revealing how prehistoric birds thought, saw, and moved. For example, the discovery of Nava Ornus hestii, an 80-million-year-old bird, provided a rare look at an ancient bird's brain and inner ear structure. Researchers found that these birds had a mix of primitive and modern brain features, showing that intelligence in birds has been evolving for millions of years. And say, with these 3D models, scientists can compare prehistoric bird brains to modern ones, revealing how areas responsible for vision, coordination, and learning have expanded over time. This explains why today's birds, like crows and parrots, are some of the smartest creatures in the animal kingdom. Have you ever marveled at the dazzling, iridescent feathers of a peacock? Scientists now believe that some dinosaurs and early birds had shimmering, color-changing feathers too. By analyzing fossilized melanosomes, tiny structures that influence feather color, scientists discovered that dinosaurs like microraptors may have had glossy, eye-catching feathers. This suggests that even in prehistoric times, appearance mattered for attracting mates, scaring predators, or blending into the environment. Birds didn't always look the way they do today. Their bodies transformed over millions of years, evolving from theropod dinosaurs into the lightweight agile creatures we see now. One of the most important changes was the shortening of the tail, which improved balance and flight control. Another key adaptation was the evolution of specialized shoulders, allowing birds to achieve powered flight an ability that gave them an edge when other dinosaurs perished. And just when we think we figured it all out, new fossil discoveries continue to challenge our understanding. The discovery of Bamanornis gengensis already pushed back the origins of modern birds, but scientists believe there are even older bird ancestors waiting to be found. 
Fossil-rich sites in China, Spain, and Mongolia continue to yield astonishing finds, each revealing a different piece of the puzzle. Every new fossil discovery better clears the story of bird evolution. Now, after these discoveries, scientists have found some clear similarities between today's modern birds and ancient dinosaurs. Let's discuss them one by one. Skeletal structure. Birds share several skeletal features with theropod dinosaurs, particularly the colorosas. These include hollow bones, a three-to-toed limb structure, and a swiveling wrist bone known as the semi-lunate carpal, which is crucial for the wing movement in birds. Additionally, both groups possess a furcular, or wishbone, formed by the fusion of two clavicles, serving as a brace during flight or predatory actions. Feathers. While feathers are quintessentially associated with birds, fossil evidence reveals that many theropod dinosaurs also had feathers. For instance, species like Cynosauropteryx exhibited primitive feather-like structures, suggesting that feathers originally evolved for insulation or display rather than flight. Reproductive behavior. Both birds and certain dinosaurs laid eggs and exhibited nesting behaviors. Fossilized nests and brooding postures, such as those found in oviraptorid dinosaurs, indicate that these creatures cared for their offspring in ways similar to modern birds. Long structure. Theropod dinosaurs had a complex system of air sacs akin to those in modern birds, facilitating efficient respiration. This adaptation supports high metabolic demands, which would have been beneficial for both active predation and, eventually, flight. Sleeping posture. Fossils of certain theropods, like Mei Long, have been discovered in a sleeping posture, remarkably similar to that of modern birds, with the head tucked under the forelimb, a behavior thought to conserve body heat. Growth patterns. Studies indicate that some dinosaurs exhibited growth rates comparable to those of modern birds, differing significantly from the slower growth observed in reptiles. This rapid growth is associated with warm-bloodedness, a trait shared by both birds and their dinosaur ancestors. With every fossil we uncover, we get one step closer to solving the mystery of bird evolution. But what other secrets might still be buried beneath the earth? Only time will tell. If you found this video fascinating, don't forget to subscribe and check out this next video popping on the screen.